feel like, to be 100% honest, you know what I'm saying? If I had to choose a side, I'm You ain't nothing but a bro, boy, 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 bro, boy, bro, motherfucking boy, bro, boy, bro, boy, bro, motherfucking boy. Hey, man. Nate's about to hoop. Hope this is a great angle, man. We just getting a little warm up, you know what I'm saying, before I drop off this nigga DDG, you know what I'm saying, and get my, you know what I'm saying, W. You know, I already let them know I'm gonna drop you off soon. I just need to warm up, you know what I'm saying? Bro, we on my squad, we winning, nigga. We winning. Shoot that light. Shoot that light. Go! We just keep starting! No! Yeah! Three points! Go ahead. 
took the easy dub. Jordan with the game winning layup. Okay. Yeah. The next morning. I'm already starting off the day not in a good mood right now, man. I'm trying to get the last of this 2K18 juice out the way before 2K19 comes out. Um, this is actually going to inspire me to pre-order 2K19 today. Um, I was trying to find a way to get it for free because I feel like 2K does not deserve a dime from me. But, um, you know, I couldn't find no connect, so I sadly had to find, um, you know what I'm saying, uh, to get it myself. So anyway, um, I'm playing 2K18, bro. And I'm about to leave the house. I'm hoping to get this W. You know what I'm saying? And they're on their bullshit as usual, bro. Now, I'm playing an online ranked match. The only thing I'm going to be playing on 2K19 and then so forth. And this is really fun. It's like the online ranked match. It's in the micro mode. But I'm playing an online ranked match. I'm playing with the all-time magic. You feel me? And notice how you see this nigga LeBron drive to the rim. You know what I'm saying? I end up losing this game by three points. Okay? I want you guys to remember that and note that. LeBron always gets a foul as usual. But which? No, watch. Watch Shaq, you know what I'm saying, right now. He literally goes up and tips the ball right in like he plays for the whole fucking Miami Heat. Okay? I want to, I want to replay it again. Maybe, maybe it was too fast. Maybe some people don't understand it. My team is the white team. The opposite team that I'm playing, some random dude from around the world, is black. The Miami Heat. Okay? The black jerseys, okay? Now, he's going to the rim. Nothing is going to happen. It was going to be just a foul, a missed bucket, two points. But instead, Shaq tips it in to give him a free and one. And look how much I lose the game by, bro. 61 to 58. I lose the game by three points because of that bullshit, bro. That's exactly why Ronnie... 2K did not want to invite me to the 2K19 event because you're a soft ass dude. You're soft. You didn't want to hear my mouth. You are a disgrace. And now I see why LD left. You are just absolutely. You don't. You never cease to amaze me, bro. There's no nothing you could say right there that was the most bullshit I've ever seen. Like I said, man, I'm about to leave the house. Man. I need to get up out the house. Oh man, Tuesday. It's crazy because back in the day when I was in school, I used to be in school or whatever, I would look at like Tuesdays or Mondays. Actually, Mondays to be real with you, as the worst days of the week. But now I'm starting to look at like Tuesdays as the worst day of the week. Like Mondays, like. I don't even know now looking back on why people usually hate Mondays. Like, I know it's like the start of the week where you gotta either go back to work or school for most people. But, like, sometimes it's like the start of, like, a brand new week. Like, it's a start where you can get a fresh, like, ideas and, like, a thinking of what you're trying to do. Like, Tuesdays is really the bitch days because, like, think about it like this. If somebody's able to get up for school for the first time when they're starting to wake up at like 7 o'clock, it's easier for them to do that on the first day because it's just like, okay, it's your first time. But you do that the second day, my nigga, like, you really feel it. Watch, I, I promise you, I bet you anybody that's about to start school or started school already, look at the people, especially, nah, it's both, it's both uh, male and females. But look at, you know what I'm saying, especially the, uh, the females that they usually look prettier or the finest on that first day of school compared to the second day of school. The second day of school, sometimes they don't even be giving a fuck how they look, but the first day they want to dress and impress, you know what I'm saying? And then when it goes to Wednesday, everybody's like the hump week, Thursdays and Fridays be the lit days. Thursdays, to me, sometimes is more lit than Fridays. I don't know why. Saturdays, you know what I'm saying, I mess with too. But comment down below right now, everybody. Um, I hope that analogy made sense, by the way, everybody, too. Um, comment down below your favorite day of the week. You know, my definite favorite day of the week has to probably be... I'm going to still say Thursday, bro. I like Thursdays. I don't know why, because it's just like I feel like it's like you, you can mess with the throwback times and everything. You can dress a certain way. I don't know, man. I mess with Thursdays the hardest, man. Yeah. FTC... Hey man, so it's nighttime, man. I need to cop my PC 2K19 about to come out, man. It's gonna go full fledged ham. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about hands where I never went with gaming shit, bro. I need to get this PC. I need to stop bullshitting. You know what I'm saying? At this point of my life and career on tube, man, it just had the full throttle. You know what I'm saying? Every time I go on stream, for some reason it's just lit. 
I have my highlights everywhere on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? I see people in the comments, they just enjoy this shit. So it's just getting to a point where, you know, you just gotta invest on certain things. I'm here to look for my PC, man. Long story short, um, especially with 2K19 is coming out. I pre-ordered 2K19 today, finally. 2K, Ronnie, you can suck my dick because you did not deserve that 100 bucks. But because the game is basketball and it's the only basketball game out that's actually somewhat good because EA doesn't know what the fuck they're doing. Them devs are mentally challenged. You know what I'm saying? Um, 2K is just a high in demand game. So, you know, the kids gonna be back on this other channel flight. Make sure y'all sub to that channel. You know, it's just gonna be a nice ride. We're gonna be back with story times and all that, man. Get ready. You know what I'm saying? People that was OG subs. Y'all gonna be in for a good treat, man, because it's like a long awaited, you know what I'm saying? Um, what's that, what's that, what's, what's that word? Um, setback for a minor, major comeback, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, man, this man Chino about to get me right, you know what I'm saying, with all this PC ish. Man. Nice day to go in the pool. Find a place to talk to about this, man. Uh, what's going on in the YouTube community, bro? <sighs> man, I dropped something. I don't know what's going on, bro. But besides all the drama, man, your boy flight need to cut. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm gonna do something about you know decision on what I'm gonna do with my hair and stuff after this but I'm gonna speak on the fact that something more important I know you guys by this point have seen the DDG and pretty boy Fredo drama you know what I'm saying and a lot of people surprisingly been asking me what are my thoughts about it it was a situation where I have to you know what I'm saying say something you know what I'm saying because I mess with both of them both of them are homies you know what I'm saying and I just feel like to be 100% honest, you know what I'm saying? If I had to choose a side, I'm neutral. Like, you know, I took the time to look at the videos the other day. Um, long story short, the reason why I didn't upload, I had a very personal matter that I had to address. Like, it was really like, you know what I'm saying, something like that I needed to ASAP. And I was, you know what I'm saying, stressed out and everything. Didn't want to take that out on you guys, you know what I'm saying? Um, but I ended up happening to see first a Twitter video, you know what I'm saying, from Fredo and then, you know, both channels uploaded it, so I definitely, you know what I'm saying, took the time, looked at both sides and everything, and you know, coming, you know, to it, conclusion, bro, at the end of the day, it's just basketball, you know, um, either or wasn't right, nor, um, Fredo wasn't right for, um, you know what I'm saying, for going off on certain circumstances nor was you know what i'm saying maybe ddg wasn't right if you think in your opinion you know what i'm saying um taking it out on certain circumstances you know but overall i don't look at them no different i don't look at ddg different i don't look at pretty boy fredo different i don't look at ssh different i don't look at uh uh ddg squad different you know what i'm saying like it's neutral like that's just really my thing towards i just this situation is over basketball at the end of the day you know what I'm saying? Like, I could see if, like, somebody, like, fucked someone's sister or something or, like, beat up their mom or some shit. You know, that's something more personal. Then you have to be like, okay, you have to sit up here and really choose a side because you're looking like a fake one. But, you know, it's over basketball. I feel like in my position, if someone was in my position, like, they're, you know, because... Fredo, me and him go way back, and even Pontiac too, you know what I'm saying? Like, and, and you, anybody was in my same situation, I feel like I'm in the right, you know what I'm saying? I, I feel like it'll be wrong for me to sit up here and be like, oh, nah, this nigga Fredo is fucking being extra aggressive, he's doing this or that, or nah, this nigga DDG is so immature, he's always taking it out on Twitter, like, it's over basketball at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? So it's not really my position to be, you know, choosing up and choosing sides. So if you're wondering, I'm neutral about this. I don't really care to be 100% honest. I just wanted to address it to give you guys my, you know what I'm saying, thoughts about it and to let you guys know where I stand. I don't look at nobody else different in none of the situations. You know, it's just, it was basketball, man. It's literally basketball, you know? Not in the NBA, man. Things get heated from time to time. You know what I'm saying? Shit, I'm not perfect either, bro. Like, I don't have my camera and recording it all the time, but there's been certain situations where like, fucking, I've done extra the most and stuff over just a street basketball game you know what i'm saying so nobody's perfect you know so that's just my thoughts about it and that's simple i need a haircut though man like really bad 
I was gonna do something because a lot of people was like 50-50 on keep the hair, keep the waves and all of that, you know? So here's what I'm gonna do, y'all. I'm gonna take this quarter, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna flip it and if it gets if it gets heads, I keep the waves. If it gets tails, this is my last haircut. Alright, so here we go. Shh, this is gonna decide, y'all. That just say tails, son. Oh lord. How you doing, miss? Can I get her you? Good. We gonna grow our hair back, y'all. Y'all, we landed on tails. Y'all seen that live in full effect. Damn. So I'm about to go get a haircut, y'all. I hope you guys understood the situation and where I'm coming from, and hope it answered. You know, I feel like, like I said, I'm right in the situation. I don't think, you know, there's no room for me to sit up here and try to choose up sides or choose up who's the victim or who's, you know, what I'm saying, the aggressor in the situation. Both of the sides were wrong, you know, and that's all that you know matters is just coming to an agreement and just recognizing what you did, you know, as an adult at the end of the day. Flight team, stand up. What are you doing with your life right now, man? Wake up. Stop being a square. How you gonna sit up here and click on the video? How you gonna sit up here and click on anything on my social media without copying you some merch? Stop sleeping. Cop up. Flightreacts.com.